Hey there, folks. This video is on one of the four patron servers uh, for my community. And if you want to know anything about Patreon, because a lot of people ask about it pretty frequently, you can check the link in the description below. Now, I can tell you a little bit about it. What a Patreon is, it's a system of support for content creators where you can support them monetarily, um, give them donations, and then you get a number of rewards for doing so. And so uh, some of the great rewards for ours is that we've got four of these ARC servers. And so these ARC servers are also hosted by Logic servers who've done a really great job um, hosting our servers and it's a sponsorship. They give it to us for free. And so if you want to know anything about that or if you're interested in ARC servers, they do a really great job. Check the link below. There's a, like uh, some sort of discount that you get by using my referral code. So if you want an ARC server and you want it cheaper, you want to check it out. Logic servers is a great place. Check the link below. If you want to know anything about Patreon, check the link below and hope you guys enjoy the video. Hey there folks, Mazion reporting for duty, and today we're playing Ark Survival Evolved on the Mazionites Vanilla Island map server. That's where we're at, right? <laughs> always, yes, that's where we're at. Whenever we get on the Mazionite servers, I'm always confused. There's so many, and then I'm like, oh, which one am I on today? Anyway, so what we're doing today is we're trying to tame one of the new dinos, uh, the Chalicotherium, or Chalicotherium. And those are located in the snow biome, and I've got Fire Acid here with me. What's up, Fire Acid? Not a lot. What's new with you, Mansion? Not much. Just uh, trying to bang out some work so I can go to Japan. You know, that whole thing. Yes. Need all the Japanese candy. It's right. I, I, is the Japanese candy good? There, there are some candies that are there that are delicious, yes. Oh, well, then I'll have to try that. I'll have to get them to tell me what is the best Japanese candy to eat and have them stuff it in my face. Um, um. So these uh, Chilicotheriums, they... they spawn in the snow biome and they require beer to passively tame so i went to my center map server and you know obviously i have no beer there and because i never made beer before so we've got beer like brewing there now but i realized it takes six hours to brew a beer so i tried to see if anybody here had beer and gunny part one of the patrons in my community had some beer and isn't really playing here anymore so we went and grabbed up all this beer and fire has uh, the Quetzal and has all kinds of, she got me some fur armor so we would be nice and, you know, warm when we get in the cold in there and whatnot. So we're going to go in there today. We're going to tame up a couple of these Chalicotheriums and we're going to play around on them and have some fun. We've spotted our first three of the Chalicotherium thingies. So I don't know if they, like, get skittish if you get too close to them. What do you think? Um, that's Mission Impossible. I'm going to touch it. Oh, yep. Yeah. You touch it, it oh it oh, attacks oh, oh it's no mad. it's mad that's not good i don't have any weapons actually i don't have anything i'm naked oh crap it threw a snowball at me did you see that oh yes it's oh yes look at that Am do i have god mode on or something yeah i must have god mode <laughs> Cheap god. turn god mode off all right now it's hitting me this makes more sense like why do i have god mode on must have been doing something the last time we were here all right, well, it's not its not throwing snowballs at me anymore, and I have no idea how much the snowballs hurt. Did you check the levels of the other ones? They're low. They're one's four, that one's eight. I don't know where the third one went. It's over here. It's 108! We gotta tame the 108! Oh, she's mad at you. Oh, apparently you can't get close. Like, ow, she threw a snowball! Wait, we made my, my screens all poopy. Was it a poopy snowball? I'm like, I'm like slowed or something. She, she's cheating. She's using the mud balls, man. Ow, she threw it. The, what the crap? Get, get, get on the, get, get, get up here. Fly away. No, no. She made the quite so slow with her poop ball. That's awesome. So we got to figure out how to tame these girls or guys or whatever. You put these in your last lot and they're fed beer. So I've got some beer here. And now we're going to see if we can actually, like, tame one of these up. 108's amazing. It's a, oh, it's mad still! It's mad! Well. So what do you do? How do you, like, stealthily shove beer in its in its butt? Especially in the cold. Right, cold butt beer. It sounds terrible. <laughs> Just Steve-o. Yes. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, look, it's mad again. 
Oh no no, they're fighting wolves. They're fighting wolves. Oh no. Well it's it could be good. That's a it's a pretty ballerific 108. Oh yeah, they beat the crap out of that wolf. Man. Alright, so we've got two down here. One's almost dead, and then we've got the 108 hanging out. So I guess maybe it's kinda like a kinda like a a, a Gigantopithecus where like it's got a cone in front, and then so you gotta shove stuff in its butt. And then if it yeah. turns around and looks at you, you're in trouble. And then run. Alright, well let's have a we're gonna have a look at it here. I don't want this crappy little guy. He's got weird blood butt problems. Um, all right, all right, all right. Here, here we go. I'm going up to the 108. All right, behind it, behind it, behind it. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. I fed it. I fed it. And it's mad. And it's mad. I, I fed and it's it. very mad. Wait, I, I didn't feed it. I just made it mad. So what do you, do we need to like? Oh crap. Oh no! Don't throw poop balls at me. Uh, do do we need to like? Oh, I can't I can't get out. Help! Fire! Pick me up! Help! 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 I'm slow. Get me! Oh man, thank you. You're my savior. So we needed to, we needed to devise a strategy, and we'll be back in just a moment once we have. All right. So we made some ghillie suits, and we brought. This 108, who's almost dead because it was being killed by a, ty a Tyrannosaurus Rex, up into the volcano. We're going to drop it on this one side, away from where the structures are, and then fly away. And hope that it doesn't despawn, and uh, that it'll also stop being mad. It's kind of stuck. You see it not moving? Yes, it's good. I guess. Like, is it... What's happening? It's probably confused. I would be confused if it went to pick me up and took me to a volcano. Oh, I didn't put your shoes. I didn't put your shoes back in the. Your shoes are in the Quetzal. So fire, I fire died. I dropped her and she died. But she's alive now. <laughs> it looks like it's just kind of in limbo. What's it doing? Oh, I bet you it's glitched and we can't tame it now. We should try. I'm I'm trying to find a way to get around to its butt. Oh. I, I can pick you up and drop you. Yeah, that might work. Um, for, for, I'm on top of things. Got the ghillie suit. Oh, oh, I think I'm going to make it. Oh, no, 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 I'm stuck. Oh. I, got, I got this. Don't worry. I've got this. Okay. Right. I'm, at it, I'm at its butt. Oh, not I can't. I put beer in it. I put beer in it. Yay. It's not moving. This is perfect. So... This is what you gotta do, guys. Just bring it up to the volcano, drop it right in this exact spot, and then it won't move. And then you're good. Oh, yes. <laughs> All right. So now, now I gotta come back down and get more beer, because I I don't have enough to tame it up with. Hopefully this process goes as smooth as it feels like it's going. Yes. Oh crap! I put way too much way too much beer on me. Nine is what we need ish to do it on this server because we've got eight times rates. Right. But we've got the saddles to, to do two of these. Jeez, um, this is a difficult process. It's Jumping like up hard, and... What's up? Hardcore parkour. Hardcore right. parkour. Right. Oh, man. Apparently, I'm not hardcore at parkour. Oh. So the interval on these guys will be a couple minutes. I got up here before. What the crap's happening? Oh, there. Oh, crap. Oh, no. I'm in a bad place. Oh, the struggle is real. The struggle is real. Oh, oh man. Oh, okay, okay, I made it. I made it. I made it. So, are you excited for some more of our Patreon events? I am. Yeah, we're gonna have some more Patreon events coming up here soon. We're gonna do like what? Mazion, uh, Mazionite skeet shooting. Yes, you're gonna, you're gonna. So, yeah, you guys just wait, just wait, watch. It's gonna be exciting. But right. yeah, <gasps> gonna... it's moving. It. It it's probably, it probably realized. Oh man, the humanity, the calico theory of manity. What the crap? So apparently all of the dinos that are up here are on aggressive. Uh, and so yeah. the Chilicotherium made its way over here and then all of this crap killed it. Very frustrating. Very frustrating. But so we're gonna go out and get two more, BRB.
We're back at the volcano with another level 108 Chalicotherium. Chalicotherium. I can't remember what it is called. Chalicotherium. Chalicotherium. Yes, we're there and we have figured out that you can just hold it and stuff beer in its butt while it's being held. And that's what Fire's doing right now. She's a very diligent butt beer stuffer. No? Yes? Maybe? Yes. <laughs> I think. It had the E. And and I, I I there's no eat now so oh it's not working anymore. Did you maybe get too close to it? Maybe. Uh oh. So let's see if we can reset it. I'm gonna like bring it way far away from you. Oh man, it, I think it hit me. I think it's gonna be mad at me, no matter what I do now. Hmm. So what if we put it down? D. Oh no, and I think it I think it's good. I think it's good. Maybe. No, no, it's it wants it wants you fire. It's, its head is looking at you. It's like, man, I want that fire acid over there. I'm gonna kill that. I want to eat it. Maybe it's looking at me. I don't know what's going on. We're gonna bring it back now that I've had it away from you. But you said the first time that you went up to it, it still had that, right? Yeah. Do you have your ghillie suit on? I do not. Can you bring it up? I must accidentally drink a beer again. No, oh, don't do that. Where did you go? Oh, you're over there. Okay. Yeah. Do you have your ghillie suit on now? I do. I don't know if it's mad at me or mad at you or what the deal is with it now, but we might have to like set it down and pick it back up. Oh God, do I need to be lower? A little bit. I don't want to hit your body with it, so watch out. That's really low. You have to do it from the butt, I think. If you do it in front, it might get mad. No, it's not letting me feed it. It's not letting you. So we're going to try some things and see if we can get this to work for us. BRB. Does it, from, does it still from, have the thing with the butt? Yes, it has the thing with the butt. All right, cool. So what we did was we stuck it back up in that corner where we de the first time and then got it to where it was able to be butt fed and then picked it up and brought it down here and are now butt feeding it here pretty amazing because beer because beer because felch um, i just think that's a weird weird game mechanic that we need to get something drunk to tame it yeah i don't really get the whole like let's feed this beer to tame it either it doesn't really make much sense to me but hey maybe you know i mean certain animals like the beer i guess I guess. Hmm, I don't know. But so we're going to be back when this one is tamed up. We'll check out its stats and whatnot. Then we're going to tame another one. Then we're going to run around and have fun. Hooray. Okay, we think we're on the last feeding for this dino. And I, look at its look at its mutton chop. It should be in the 70s band. And it's got a horse face. A face like a horse. Yes. Isn't that weird fire? All right. I think, I think it's adorable. So I've got a great view of the grundle and fire. Oh, there we go. We've tamed it. They've tamed it. Let's put it down. Oh, it's following fire. Okay. It is. Stop it doing that. Me. So we've got one tamed. Uh, rank zero, order rank zero. Yeah, we know all that stuff. And it's got uh, 3,480 health, uh, 1,000 stamina. We've got 544 weight and 364% melee damage. So it looks like it's a pretty good one. Yeah? Yeah. I don't know. We haven't seen any others, but you know. So we're going to do the same thing to another one. And when we're about to tame that one, we're going to get on them, ride them around, show you what it's all about. Okay, we're back. And we found a level 92 uh, Chilicotherium. And we decided that we would tame it off cam. And it just finished up. And this one is prettier. Don't you think? Yes, I think so. Did you did you grab the other side L? Nope. That. I have the other don't. side L. I am. Where's yours? Oh, over there. I thought, this, I thought this one was mine. Do you want? Do you, you can have whichever one you want. Which one do you I, want? I don't. I don't care. Well, you, you get to decide. I only took this one because it was the lower one. I don't. I don't care. Holy crap! Whoa! <laughs> so if you're not in the snow, it picks up rocks. I did not know that like, was going to happen. It's like, it's like donkey, donkey Kong. It's like oh, Donkey just, Kong. And I just drank beer again. Uh oh. So on this guy, we've got 4,200 health, 870 stamina, 520 weight, 336% melee damage, and 100% movement speed. Oh crap! Oh! You just threw a rock at me! 
Ah! Oh, shenanigans! <laughs> it's so fun! <laughs> yeah! So we gotta bring these things down the mountains somewhere where we can fight some things. And they're so slow! When they walk, they're so slow. They are. But the, the, the gallopy motion actually feels very horse-like. Well, it's because I guess they're related to the horse. Oh, crap. We got stuck together. I didn't name mine yet. Did you name yours? Mm -mm. I'm going to name mine. Change name. Maz Mutton Chops. No, Mutton Chops McGee. That's right. Hopefully it's... Yeah, it all, it all fits. What did you name yours? Spice McKinley. It says Chilicotherium. Hold on. Now, do they eat meat or berries now, or do they, we still have to feed them beer forever? I don't know. It's taking you an awful long time to name that thing. Because I don't know how to spell Mackenzie. <laughs> oh, get a, get a little up. So that mine is Mutton Chops McGee and hers is Spud Mackenzie. We're going to go find some stuff to fight. Come All right, our first fight is a Spino. Catapult. Catapult. Just throw rocks at it. Or I am. You're tanking it. Oh, now it's, is it running away already? It is. It is. It's this a big scaredy. See? I'm not afraid of nothing. Stupid, wimpy Spinosaurus. No, get stuck. Get stuck. Oh, throw rocks. To, to, to be fair, we are pretty magnificent, so. This is pretty amazing. We just beat the... It was a 108? Was that a 108? I think so. I think it said 108. We just killed a 108 Spino. These guys are awesome. Favorite new mount, maybe? For sure. Oh, very slow swimmer. There's some wolves over here. Let's kick the crap out of them. And then that titanosaur. We, let's not go near that at all. Oh, mega piranhas. I'm gonna throw a rock at the mega piranha. Aha! <laughs> oh, great success. Crap, crap, they're eating my butt. Crap, they're eating my butt a lot. Holy crap, help, help. You got oh, this. Oh, man. They you are serious business. They kick the crap out of dire wolves. Yeah. You know what? We should have made We should have made some tasty cakes. Oh, yeah. We might have to do that before the day's over. We'll see what happens. But so they harvest berries and they harvest thatch and like a little bit of wood. But the th they're, they're primarily thatch getters. We got to get ourselves up to where we can fight some, some of them rexes. That's not going to be it. Is this not the right way to go? We're stuck. We're gonna find a way around and get ourselves up there. We have found a Rex. It is time to do the ultimate test for any vanilla dinosaur. Rah. Bro rocks. Oh wait. Oh. Uh. Okay. Uh, that was too easy. Uh, let's kill all of the other things in the area as well. So these guys uh, are immensely, immensely fun as a uh, as a dino. And they beat the crap out of everything. And the rocks that they throw are super duper strong. There's another another Rex up here. And watch, if I throw straight up. Oh, I I I, I didn't I didn't wait long enough. You throw it straight up. Oh, oh, I didn't see what happened. Crappy! If you throw it straight up! There, it throws it up! Oh crap! Hopefully self-damage isn't a thing. Where did that Rex go? It's it's afraid of us. I'd be scared of us. I'd be scared of us too. Where oh it's over here. Now we can just throw rocks at it from the from the hill. Stupid Rex! Die! Wait, did it die already? Oh my god. Oh, it was level four, but still. Where'd you go, Fire? Right here. You missed it! I killed it all by myself. Can you hit the RG? Oh crap, I hit you. Oh, we're missing. You know what would be nice missing. for once that a, a dino, like if you throw stuff, it goes at the center of where your cursor, you know, like where your cursor should be. Right. <laughs> I would love that. Or that, or that you could you could get a, uh, a crosshairs. On right. The because now you can pull out your gun. I don't know. Do you have your gun? Uh, no, I don't have a gun. Let alone many guns that would facilitate an entire rack. Well. 
<laughs> Wayne's World reference check. Another. I, 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 you didn't know that. You don't know that quote. No, I don't watch Wayne's World. I'm sorry. It's like right at the beginning. In the beginning. You gotta, gotta watch those movies. Fire. They're amazing. I, I know. And then maybe I'll be on the same page as Cedric. But. As who? Cedric. Oh, Cedric. Yes. Who gets, who gets mixed up between Wayne's World and uh, Bill and Ted's Bogus Journey? Excellent adventure. Yeah. Throw rocks. Fire help. You had that, man. But totally it, had it. But it would be way more epic if we were both destroying it. I was trying, but my C key is not working. But there's another one. So they seem to have pretty good stamina. You don't have to worry about that so much. Nope, oh, I'm stuck. Let's get, let's get on this rock here and throw rocks at it. More melee damage. I want to know why we're not throwing snowballs. All oh, right, right. Did you try C? It's because... Oh, C's weird. Throw rocks! Yeah. Aha! Ow! Jerk. Are you hitting Both it? for Rexes. Yeah, I don't know. It was weird. Like, C... C doesn't throw anything. Uh-uh. It does, like, a weird, like, gather move type like thing. A oh, you killed it. Or the, the wolf down there killed it. <laughs> Bye, wolf. So yeah, uh, let's check out the C move. So we got the 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 one move and does 31 Tinto berries per swipe, and then that move did about 30, it's about the same, I guess. I don't know. Like, do they does it pick up more narco berries with one than the other? I don't know. I was also checking to see if like the weight difference was if they reduced weight, but they don't. So I don't know. What, what about let's try it on a tree. Let's try the face move on a tree. Because they get uh, thatch with the hand move. Yeah, they still get more touch than wood. Well, what the... Excuse me. What are the crap is the difference? Maybe, like, just proximity. One, like, swipes an area. Maybe one does more damage. We gotta make a dummy. Wait. Dummy. Training dummy. Learned. Needs. Touch wood. Fiber. Hide. Crap. You know, this should be able to get hide off of dinos. Do we, ch do we check that yet? No, we don't get hide. That's stupid. It's got claws, like ridiculous claws. Come back out! Oh, well, that's all right. I got one behind me. Oh, look, the area of effect attack goes all the way behind it. So that might be a thing. Yeah. Um. All right, all right. No, that that. See, like I should be getting hide with these claws, man. Redonkulously. I I don't have any tools. Do you have any tools? No. You don't have a anything like a pick? No. Where did the pick go? I gave it back to you. Well, I'm, all right. So we're gonna get, we're gonna get all the crap to make them dummy, so we can see if there's any difference between those two attacks. It doesn't really make any sense. Okay, so we made a little dummy here, and at first I wanted to note the the square butt patch uh, of fur on on the dino. It's got a weird like jutting out square butt patch. I don't understand why that is there. But it is. And then so we tried to not burp, but we burped anyway. We tried to figure out uh, what the two attacks differences were. So here's a dummy, right? Right? So you can go, you know, face attack. Face attack. 34, 76. Swipe attack. 39, 11. And the swipe attack, I don't, can we, we can get it from the back, right? Oh. Yeah. Well, it's not. Oh, server's lagging. Server's saving. There's a problem. Right. So you see, I'm hitting it from here. Right? Can I hit it from the back with it? So this one does not hit behind me. So maybe that's the thing. Maybe it's just like, so you don't, I don't know, make whatever's behind you angry? Maybe. It's like a directed attack? Because the other one's a big, big AOE. And then fire, show them what happens when you throw a rock at it. Put her on the spot. Oh, oh you missed. <laughs> I'm bad. Oh, you missed again. Yay! There we go. Oh, mine must have way more melee damage than yours. Yeah. Look at this. 10,857! As opposed to... 3,911. Like, it's this is the coolest dino ever. Look how good it corners, too. You're like... Burp, 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 burp. And you want to show them the other thing that it does, Fire? Yeah. Show them that other thing? You can make it sit! 
It's like a it's like a weird human horse. It's like a weird human horse, yes. <laughs> it's, it's so weird. It's like front arms are longer than its back legs. Its back paws are like wolf paws. Its front claws are like lion claws. What the crap is this thing? And it's got a horse face with mutton chop sideburns. What the and then it's got this weird square butt patch. I don't understand this dino, but I, it is the most epic dino I've ever ridden ever in Ark ever. Ever. Oh, and then also there's this other neuter, and you have to hold to activate. So you got to be sure. So we're sorry. They didn't like it. We're so sorry. We're so sorry that you've been neutered. Can you, and there's no unneuter. No, there's no, it, once it's done, it's done. But it didn't change down here. There's nothing different. Nope. It's the same as it ever was. It's just like the talking heads. Yes. I don't understand. I don't understand. But these are awesome. I had a lot of fun with them. What about you? I did. Yeah, for sure. Oh, I didn't see. Oh, I don't have my. See how much DPS we can get with this thing. Bam. Only 4,343 so far. It's got to be more than, I guess maybe that's that's why it's so much. Because how much DPS can I get with the claw? Oh, I'm sorry. I'll stop. Yeah, <laughs> that's affecting my DPS. Claw DPS is 4,694, so it's similar. And then what face DPS? Oh, I got to keep pressing it. Face DPS. Base attack sucks. Yeah, it's it's super slow. Weird. But rock attack is amazing. This is the most amazing dino that there was ever in Ark today so far. Yes. Do you think? I think so, yeah. It's my new favorite for sure. Bye bye, Spino. Jellicotherium. In incoming. <laughs> Horse dog pony. That's right, Horse Dog Pony. Anyway, that's going to be it for today's episode, folks. If you liked it, make sure you blast the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to Maze on Plays Games. And as always, be excellent to each other. Have a great day. See you later. Say bye, fire. Bye.